Hello guys, this is first video in our maths calculation trick series and in this video I will tell you how to calculate a square root of a number very easily. So let's start uh, with our first question that is uh, we have to find the square root of 576 in very less time. Uh, you don't have to do stuff like reverse calculation or the just memorizing the these stuffs. So let's go to the trick now. For the computation for learning this trick, you must have to learn these numbers. Like you must have to learn the squares of number from one, two, three, four, five, six, one to nine, basically. So you have to learn the square of the number from one to nine and the last digit of the square of the number. Like last digit of thirty six is six. So I have written 6 here and last digit of 64 is 4 so I have written 4 here. All we need is this particular list to calculate any numbers square root. So uh, we have the number which is 576. Okay. For calculating the square root we first have to look at the number at the ones place. 6. Okay, fine. For the first step, for the if we look into the uh, ones place of the number, we have to look on the this list. Means the list of the last digit. Means six comes in which column? Six is here, corresponding to the number six, and six is here, corresponding to the number four. So we would write here four or six. Okay, and uh, after that, we will cut the initial two number and look into the third number, which is five. So, for looking into second step, we have to look into the squares of the number, and uh, we have to find the number just below five. Means if from starting from here, one is less than five, four is less than five, but nine is greater than five. So then we would select 4 here and 4 is the square of which number 2 so our second digit will be 2 second digit is 2 first digit is 4 or 6 so finding the first digit or finding the first digit let's multiply the number just after this number 2 and see what happens we have to multiply 2 and the number just after it which is 3 3 into 2 that is 6 if this particular number if this particular number is greater than this particular number, then smaller number will be the answer. Means if 5 is less than 6, so our answer is 4. And if there would be another number which is greater than 6, then our answer would be 6. So we have the answer which is 24. Because 5 is less than 6. Okay, let's go to another example. Uh, let's think about any number. What number you can think of? Well, we can take a bigger number no now. Like, uh, let's take uh, 5, 3, 2, 9. And think about this number. Okay. So, first of all, we have to look into the first number, which is 9. And then take a look on this list. 9 comes under 3 and 9 comes under 7. So we have a controversy here like it could be 7 or 3. Now think about the second digit. Cut the initial two digit. What is left? We left with 53. And uh, let's look in the squares of the number. 1 is less than 53, 4, 9, 16, 25, 36, 49, 64. 49 is less than 53, but 64 is greater than 53. So we would we would take this number 49. And 49 is the square of 7. So our second digit is 7. Okay. Now multiply the number 7 by number just after it. That is 8. So 7 into 8, that is 56. 
and 53 is less than 56 so the smaller number would be the answer so our answer is 73 quite easy trick it is okay let's try another example it would be better if you guys try it so let's take another example we can take any number so let's take 961 so what should I do now think first of all look into this number 1 and then have a look on this list where the 1 come 1 comes in the number 1 and for the number 9 so 1 and 9 cut the initial two digits think about the third digit 9 1 4 and 9 we have the closest number 9 so 3 would be the second digit okay now multiply 3 with the number just after it and 12 and 9 is less than 12 so the lesser number would be the answer means our answer is 31 and you will be faster and faster after solving every question and it is quite easy trick so there's it